Hey guys, and welcome to today's video and vlog. So I'm mainly going to be focusing on Etsy stuff and like all my work related tasks, but I am going to throw in a couple things that are just like in my day because obviously when you're an Etsy owner, you basically make your own work schedule and work it around everything else you have going on so yeah it's kind of just like a day in life but also a lot of people have requested etsy work vlogs so that's what we're doing i'm let's just get into it Alrighty, so it is currently 8 11 in the morning and i'm just going ahead and printing some shipping labels they're in this tab here but i don't want to share anybody's address so yes um i do go ahead and prep the shipping labels the night before because that's usually when i complete the orders and i know which ones are going out the next day and then i just like to print them as soon as i wake up the next day Alrighty guys, I am making a quick stop at Staples because I need to buy some shipping labels because the ones I printed this morning were my last ones. So I'm going to run in here and hope that their prices aren't a million times more expensive than online because every single time I come to Staples, their prices are always way more than shown on their website. So this is just a budget tip. If you ever need to buy anything from Staples, be sure to look online before you go so you know exactly what you need. And then once you go to the store, get that exact item. And if they are priced higher when you go to check out, feel free to show them their website because every single time I come, that happens to me and I don't know if it's only me if I have any viewers that work at Staples or have worked at Staples please let me know why that happens because I think it's really strange because like it's the items aren't on sale or anything online it's just the prices are different so yeah let me know but I'm gonna go in now and get some shipping labels alrighty guys I'm back and I'm shook to say the least so I just like for you guys you literally just saw the clip that I was talking about the prices but um so I got the shipping labels and online I came in thinking that they were $27.61 and then they tried to charge me $41.99 like I don't know why they do that, but please, if you need to buy something from Staples, just please bring the website price because they always honor in, like they never give me a problem. Like they just do it right away. But like, I don't understand that. Like that's $15. No, thank you. So yeah, just thought I'd let you know little budget tip of the day all right i'm going to the post office now Alrighty, guys i'm about to go into the post office it is only oh well it's 9 29 and the like main part of the post office opens at 9 30 so there's like a huge line inside but i don't actually have to wait in the line because i kind of just drop off my mail and check my p.o box quickly and then i leave but yeah there's a big line this morning. I'm back home now and I made myself some breakfast. So I have a everything bagel with cream cheese, one egg and one piece of ham. And then I made myself
myself an iced coffee in this Be A Good Human cup, which is just a good reminder that everybody should have. Alrighty, now I'm going to print a few things. So I'm gonna print these, which are like the closures that I put on the outside of the envelopes. So I need to print some more of these. And then, sorry about the weird coloring of the screen. That's kind of just what happens because I'm recording my computer, obviously. And then I'm just going to be printing my sticker kit for my plan with me. So today is Tuesday and on Tuesdays I film my plan with me's, my memory spread. So obviously you will see that on my channel yesterday whenever this video goes up because this video will be going up on Wednesday. So yes, go check out that video if you're interested but I have four sheets here one two three and four those are all my stickers for my plan with me already I'm going to cut the stickers now I have the closures here and then my stickers for my plan with me which is this beautiful kit here if you saw yesterday's video you would already see it but yeah gonna go because this is extremely loud alrighty guys so I'm about to film my plan with me I have all my stickers cut and ready I'm gonna show you like my setup a little bit because I've never shown this I don't think so this is actually my vanity as you can see this mirror is like connected to the desk um and I just have this tripod don't really know how to explain it but I just have it like wrapped up there and then I put my camera here and have my planner here obviously and then this is my bullet journal where I actually write down everything um, that happens and I highlight the stuff that I want to include in my video so I just have that right off to the side so like I can see what's going on and then right next to my vanity is my nightstand and I have like a big stack of stickers here for you know in case I need them but yeah that's the setup and then here's my mirror and I can always see myself which is really funny when I film because if you guys saw how I looked half the time when I filmed these plan with me's you would be dead because I always look like a wreck but that's okay I will talk to you once I'm done with this I have finished filming editing and now my plan with me is currently uploading and it is about to be two o'clock it's 1 57 so yeah that took me a very long time but i mean i was prepared for it you know my plan with me's are definitely the videos that take me longest to do but now it's time to start working on etsy orders also, here's the spread. If you haven't seen the Plan With Me video already, be sure to go check it out after you finish watching this vlog because it did go up yesterday, which is the 8th because this vlog will be going up on the 9th. So go check it out. Before I work on orders, I'm gonna go ahead and get my workout for the day complete. So this will probably take me a little more than 30 minutes to do and then I will shower and just probably work on orders for the rest of the day. So probably starting around 3.30, I will just be working, working, working. So I will see you after my workout. My workout is complete and I'm getting in the shower. I'm set up to work on orders which I will be on live on Instagram. I use like this little car mount to like hold my phone. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna be live and then after I go live, I will probably film, like vlog a bit for you guys as well to see kind of what I'm up to. Alrighty, here we are with some work content. I have went live, I've eaten dinner, now I'm going to film for you guys. 
and then I will probably go live again because I have a lot of work to do. Oh, also, that noise in the background is our dishwasher, so I'm sorry about that, but I'm gonna speed this up for you. I am taking a break from orders. Well, not really a break, but I came to cut some categories that I need to add to one of the orders that I'm working on. And then I also came over here to print the three um, labels for the orders. I'm doing actually four, but I already have one printed. So I just need to print these three. Alrighty guys, we are finally on to packaging, which is my favorite, favorite part. So I'm gonna go ahead and walk us through this portion. So to start off, I take a cello bag and then the order. So this is gonna be the first one. 
and each order gets a little freebie which i do plan on changing these very very soon because i've had these for a very long time so for the mini envelopes i just go ahead and put it right in the first envelope there and then i take the note that i wrote specifically for that person or that order for the minis i fold the note in half and i go ahead and stick them right in between the note and i make sure that the person's name is right in front and then i stick that in here of course i seal it make sure there's no excess air in there and then i take one of these little circle labels which i handwrite thank you on and I go ahead and fold over this excess bit and then seal it like that. So this is how the minis look and now let me do envelopes the classic size. So this order is very large. It's three full sets. So one set of beige, one set of red, and one set of white. So it's so satisfying when I get thick orders like this. I just love how it looks and feels and everything. So once again, I take the note and I pop it in the first, well, I didn't do this for the first one because they were minis, but for the classics, I actually put the note and the freebie inside the front envelope so then it looks like this and then i go ahead and put that in the cello bag And these envelopes, since they are larger, and then also this customer did want the extra lamination on the bottom, they actually fit perfect in these cello bags, so I don't have to fold down any excess or anything, but I still do seal the envelope. I mean, well, I guess it is kind of like an envelope, but I still seal the package in the back, so then it looks like this, which this is thick but yeah and I just do that for all my orders so I'm gonna do it for this one show you one more time and then that's probably pretty much it for this vlog because the only other thing I have to do is like putting the orders in the envelopes which you saw how I do that this morning when I um, when I did that it's the same exact thing just putting the shipping labels on the envelopes and then um, closing the envelopes with a little like logo clasp that says the planning dancer with my logo and yeah so let me just pop this on there How they look so let me show you i have a couple here so i have these three that i just packaged with you and then i have this one here that i've already packaged and i just need to package one more set of minis so i will be right back to close out the video now that i have all my orders complete i get to go through my little notebook where i write down everything and check off 
all the completed orders, which is like one of my favorite things. It's just really satisfying. So those are all the ones I did today. And let me flip you around to end this vlog. Okay, so thank you guys so much for watching today. I really do hope you enjoyed this because it was requested by multiple people. So if it is something you guys are interested in and you want to keep seeing, please give it a thumbs up or just leave me comments down below letting me know that this is something you like and you enjoy because either way I'm working and I'm doing this stuff daily so if it's something you want to see then I can just pull my camera out and film it for you guys but yes I'm going to go to bed now it is currently 11 45 p.m if you were curious um yeah making cash envelopes isn't as easy and glamorous as it seems I don't know if it seems easy or glamorous but it is a lot of hard work and I just want to say thank you guys so much for placing orders and even trusting me enough to make you cash envelopes. Also, I am sorry if I look sweaty. I'm not. <laughs> I just put like a lot of lotion on because my skin is super, super dry. So I just tried to save it because it's like so dry that it's painful. So I'm sorry about that. But yeah. I'm going to head to bed now and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.